Howdy. We're back here in the human anatomy and physiology labs at Ohio University. And today, Professor Klein here is going to take you through the large intestine. So what we can see with the large intestine is first off, it's got a ascending portion to it, transverse, descending, and then where it becomes this S shaped is sigmoid colon, rectum, and the anus. In addition to that, there's a special part at the beginning of the large intestine called the cecum. So this pouch area down here is the cecum where we can see the ilium or the most distal portion of the small intestine connecting to that cecum. Now this junction is called the ileocecal junction as shown right here. What's this red thing coming off the cecum you ask? That's the appendix. Appendix often can be inflamed through appendicitis and make sure you get that removed before it bursts because it can cause some issues. Now we also have what's called a hostra. Notice this small pouch and this small pouch and how there's these miniature compartments. Each one of those miniature compartments is a hostra that connect together to form the large intestine. Now everything else in here this is disease and different medical conditions, so don't let that throw you off as far as labeling the rest of the large intestine. 